Hey bro, if you look at the diet of people around the world, there's one thing that just absolutely drives me crazy. It is so easy to fix, but this thing kills, I believe it kills like tens of thousands of Americans each year. And it's only Americans. It messes up their hormones, it messes up their insulin. It literally gives them insulin resistance and diabetes. And again, it is so easy to fix it. This thing is snacks. Or just eating more than three times a day. Let me explain this. Every time you eat, your insulin levels rise. This is the natural body reaction that just helps the body to absorb the energy from the food. Every time you eat, even if you eat eggs without carbs, just without anything, just it will still rise because that's how it works in the body. So when a person eats six times a day, five times a day, I even see people eating 10, 10 times a day. It's insane. Why are they doing this? They obviously develop insulin resistance because the body just releases too much insulin. I mean, it's supposed to release so much insulin. It releases it because you eat too much. And so the cells, they don't need that much glucose that they're getting. Because every time insulin is released, the cells are getting glucose. The cells don't need that much glucose. That's why they're developing insulin resistance. The cells are adjusting to not let glucose in because they don't need that much again. Yeah. So when you are eat, when you eat, bro, seriously, I saw diets on YouTube that recommend eating six times a day. Why? Why would you do this? I mean, it's not only unhealthy, it's just stupid. Why would you waste time eating six times a day? Spend time on something more productive, on reading, I don't know, or whatever. Just don't eat six times a day. Eat three times a day. Eat two times a day. Two times a day is good. Sometimes I eat one time a day. One time a day. And it's still perfectly fine. If you get all the calories you need, you can eat one time a day. The best is to eat two or three times a day. Because uh, if, when you eat two or three times a day, you get enough calories. Because, well... You can just eat all your calories in three meals. Like it's not even that hard. And um, you don't spike insulin that often. What is the worst part is that they do it in schools. Like they literally give snacks to kids in schools. Hey kids, let, let's, have, let's have a snack. Let's raise our insulin for, without, for no reason. Why are they doing this? It's insanely stupid. Well, anyway, you need to be aware of how many times a day you eat. Even a small snack, again, even a small snack raises your insulin. So what I recommend doing is I don't eat at all besides the three periods when I do. I eat in the morning after my morning routine, not immediately after I woke up. It's stupid to eat after you, just immediately after you woke up. Obviously, if you are going to school, you don't have a choice. You woke up, you ate, you go, you you went to school. But if you have a chance, if you have a, um, if you have the ability to do so, do not eat after you after you woke woke up. It is bad for your guts. So the second time I eat after five or six hours after I woke up. And the second time I eat, and the third time, third time I eat, is um, three or four hours before I go to sleep. So I eat three times a day. And I don't eat absolutely anything between the meals. Because when you eat, again, your insulin raises. And your body needs time to get it down. And when insulin is constantly high, that's where the problem is. That's where the problem happens. That's where a person develops, gets skinny fat, you know? Why, why people are getting skinny fat? 
because their bodies are not working properly. Nobody is naturally skinny fat. Nobody is genetically skinny fat. It's just that their bodies are not working properly. They, they are getting too much food. Not too much, but too often. Let's say a person changes only one thing about their diet. How many times a day they eat? They eat the same amount of calories, the same amount of junk food, whatever. Just The only thing they change is, one, is that they eat one time a day now. They will be much healthier, much healthier, even if they don't change anything, even if st they still eat pizza and hamburgers and, but, and uh, french fries. They'll still be much healthier. Because the main thing in losing weight or in losing fat is you need to reduce your insulin resistance. And the only way to reduce your insulin resistance is by eating less eating less often. If you, again, I made a video about, I actually made, yeah, I made a video about diabetes. You can go watch that now. Basically, diabetes is uh, just insulin resistance. So every time you eat more than three times a day, you get a higher chance of developing diabetes. There is a statistics that tells that every one in three people in the United States have insulin resistance or diabetes. It's just insane. And the only thing we need to do to avoid this is to tell people about eating, about what eating more than three times a day is unhealthy. We don't need to change their diets. We don't need to... Make them less, make, make them eat less sugar. We just need to tell them about, you need to eat three times a day, maximum. Maybe there are some conditions, medical conditions, uh, when you need to eat more, then it's fine. Then, well, I cannot tell you to forget about your health and medical conditions and eat less than whatever you need to eat. But most people don't have these conditions and they still eat a lot, like, again, six times a day. It's just insane. And there are medical professionals on YouTube that are recommending this. Honestly, this is so stupid. Well, that's it for this video. I hope you find it helpful. I hope you won't eat uh, more than three times a day. Be healthy. Uh, be self-aware. And I'll see you in the next one.